The official logo for King Charles' coronation has been unveiled, with the floral design holding a lot of symbolism dear to the monarch's heart. The king is known for his passion for the environment, but the flowers are also carefully chosen to represent his love for his country too. The insignia features a blue crown surrounded by red flowers, with the words King Charles III, Coronation, May 6, 2023 going around it. Amongst the flowers are a rose for England, a shamrock for Northern Ireland, a daffodil for Wales and a thistle for Scotland. The shape of the flowers combined to form the design for St. Edward's crown the one which will be placed on the king's head in Westminster Abbey. The floral patterns were chosen by Sir John Neive, a British designer who once worked for Apple. Sir John e said his team was inspired by King Charles' love of the planet, nature, and his deep concern for the natural world. He said, the emblem speaks to the happy optimism of spring and celebrates the beginning of this new Carolean era for the United Kingdom. The gentle modesty of these natural forms combine to define an emblem that acknowledges both the joyful and profound importance of this occasion. In other coronation news it was revealed this week that Camilla would wear Queen Mary's crown, which does not feature the controversial coin or diamond. The crown has now been removed from the Tower of London in order to be modified before the ceremony. It is the first time in recent memory that a consort will reuse a crown, with the decision being made in the interests of sustainability and efficiency, according to Buckingham Palace. The crown will also be reset with diamonds from the late Queen's personal collection in a touching tribute to Her Majesty. Camilla has been unable to accompany her husband on his royal visits this week due to testing positive for COVID. She had been scheduled to join him in Milton Keynes on Thursday, where a reception was held to celebrate it gaining city status. On Tuesday, the king was in Hounslow meeting members of the Turkish community who are sending aid to earthquake victims. He later traveled to Trafalgar Square to meet Syrians also affected by the natural disaster.